What's up guys, it's Jay and Mix from UnboxingRocks.com and today we have a new pop single for you. Who do we have, Mix? We have Pinhead from the Hellraiser series. Scary, scary <laughs> figure. He actually still looks scary even with the <laughs> pop style figure. The cute overlay, he's still scary yeah, underneath yeah. all that. Doesn't make him look cute. What's on the box our Mix? There is Pinhead holding the puzzle box on the front there and then his little head, okay, his little head peeking up is a little bit cute on top, but then I guess if you just see the eyes. <laughs> then he's there on the side with his costume and all his like deadly weapons. And then on the back, him in his very scary movie cover pose holding the puzzle box. So uh, why does it say Hellraiser 3 and not just Hellraiser or Hellraiser 1 or Hellraiser 2? I wonder why it's 3. Yeah, it's been a while since I've seen this, well, any of these movies, but I can't remember like if there's something significant, significant with him, why this is Hellraiser 3 and not just Hellraiser. I don't know if it's like a licensing If you guys maybe? know if there's any significance to why Funko used Hellraiser 3 on the box art, let us know. Maybe because he's the one holding the puzzle box and it's more about him in Hellraiser 3? I don't know. Just a guess. But if there's an actual reason, tell us. <laughs> or, in the comments, tell us your guesses. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let, let's get him out of the box. Let's see him. Get Do your magic, guy. mix. Don't wreck the box. Okay, we are rewatching all of the Hellraisers. Oh, man. <laughs> This gives pins. us a reason to rewatch them, getting the pop. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> the pins and like the grid on his face are absolutely perfect. Like that is so perfect pinhead. That looks awesome. I love it. They're actually like he's pretty heavy. Maybe they're maybe they're real pins in there. His head feels heavy. His head feels really yeah, heavy. Yeah, <laughs> The pins go all the way through to the skull of the pop. His eyes are just like totally black and dead. And while the pins are so cool and like they, they feel awesome, they look great, his outfit is like almost even cooler than his head. He has the leather long robe on and the little slits there where I think he has like got hooks kind of there that they don't show any hooks or anything, but it's all like bloody looking. Then on his belt, He's got like all kinds of torture weapons and they're bloody as well. Oh, he has little claws. He's yeah. Like, yeah. He's got the glove that goes over his thumb and pinky on both hands and then his three other fingers are super pale and have red tipped nails on the end. And the little puzzle box, it's not obviously as detailed as the lament yeah. configuration should be, but it's got like a little gold square and circle and then like some black around the edges. Not too much detail in there, but it looks pretty cool. The leather robe has all different textures and stuff. There's even like little folds where his arms bend so he's mm -hmm. got a ton of detail this guy looks awesome he is like one of my new favorite yeah. pops <laughs> always is but no he really is he looks he's like, he actually looks scary he's so it. detailed my favorite ones are always the creepy pops because they still look mm -hmm. a little bit cute but he even barely looks cute for a pop and pops yeah. always look cute like good job Funko finally making something that doesn't look totally adorable <laughs> there's a few like that out there that pop a leg butt that looks cool still. cool like, like a little a bit, bit cute scary. but yeah it's those big round just circular eyes how do you look mean like that <laughs> but <laughs> he looks awesome I like the box art and the figure on this I really like when there's a pop that has no characters in a set or anything, mm -hmm. and then they put the full art of the character yeah. on the back. I like mm -hmm. that too, yeah. So let us know what you think. If this is one of your favorites, if you have them yet, if you're gonna get them, and while you're down there in the comments, let us know what your favorite Hellraiser movie is. <laughs> Do you have a favorite mix? I, to be honest, I don't remember. That was a long time ago. I did watch many of them. I've probably seen all of them, I think, but I barely remember them. And I've seen the original, like the, the first one, just Hellraiser, multiple, many, many times. So probably that one's my favorite. I like that one. We may watch a couple. Well, definitely the first one. And now it. I need to see it. So let us also know if you're gonna rewatch them. And if you like this video, if you like us doing pop singles, give us a thumbs up. And what else makes? Subscribe! Subscribe to our channel. I know you're going to because you guys rock!